as agree It's almost like when we first met Oh, I don't care, it's getting too late I won't The journey begins We're on the ferry Heading to the airport And then we're gonna catch a plane to the location But I'll show you guys my fit The airport fit later The AC in this boat feels so good Whew. I wish I can walk around and have this over me all the time. Yeah, the lighting isn't the best because there's light from different angles. So I'm trying to give you guys the best light. But the hair isn't dried yet. I'm excited. Just touched down in a St. Martin. First up to get the rental, and then we're going to head to the Airbnb. as you saw and we're staying in an airbnb for the first night and then today we're gonna pick up the rest of the crew and let my room st martin and then head over to the hotel later because check-in is at three or four four yes yeah, check-in is at four so they're coming in this morning and we came in last night and this is a pretty cool airbnb i'll insert the videos for a one night chill spot. The AC was cold as hell. Like, I have a habit of just turning off the AC in hotels. I complain about being hot so much and then you enter a space where it's cold as hell and then I can't, I can't, I can't do it. Don't forget, I have my period on my vacation. But it's, it's coming to an end and we love that, right? I'm trying not to let it get to me. You know how I get around that time. Moody and very weirdish but i'm doing okay day one well it's day two let's be for real day two in antigua oh gosh i'm about to say antigua hello <laughs> rewind 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 day two in saint martin <laughs> we just had breakfast at rainbow cafe and i really enjoyed it it was really good it was a different palette but it's always interesting to try different food. So I'm the rum, the rum punch connoisseur, and I can tell you that it's strong. Welcome to Tapper's Rum Distillery. My name is Cass, and today I'm the tour guide. Hi, Cass. Are you guys excited? Yes. yes. Yeah. You guys should be. Today you'll be sampling approximately 25 different flavors Jeez. of rum. Oh. So you guys 
send a poem to her. <laughs> Short introduction on how the rum came to being. I talk about some of the flavors, the awards we've won, and then you guys also get to sample a few of them. After this room, we head out next door into the laboratory, and that is where all the magic happens. So that's where you guys are going to get to cook with some rum. You'll try some rumfies cake, some rumfies gelato, and then many more flavors of port rum. After that room, we head on over into our production room. I'm actually letting you guys know that you chose a perfect time to visit Tapri's Rum Distillery. If you guys take a look on your left, or right ahead for some of you guys, you'll notice that we have a beautiful display of glass colored bottles. Which color is your favorite? Pink. Pink? Like the amber one. Red. Okay. Yeah. And what about the blue? I like the blue. blue. I like the blue. <laughs> okay. She's like, well, you gotta forget the blue. <laughs> Bye. Hmm. I like this. I like both of them though. Two of them. Yeah. 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 Which one was the um, on the, the first one? The one? That one was the dream. Yeah, they did. Yeah. Ready? We can do it together on the count of three. You guys ready? One, two, three. So take your first sip. Inhale, swallow, exhale. Oh wow! Okay. Yeah. Hey. It smells good in here. It really smells good. Me. Okay. So I'm gonna give them the opportunity to go ahead and introduce themselves to you guys. Hi, I'm Celebrity Chef Bella. <laughs> Hi, I'm Celebrity Chef Brian for One Day and One Day Only. <laughs> That's a malfunction. I guess we gotta take it home. Huh? <laughs> I like that one. It's the very last black library that you guys see on the hand syringe right here. Do you guys all see that? Mm -hmm. We place inside of the bottle, see where the fill level is. If rum needs to be taken out, then we also take out some rum. But if rum needs to be tapped up, then we also top it up with some rum. But this process is done with each and every single bottle of Topper's rum. Place the rum cake inside, close it inside a cute little bottle. Offer rum and rum for all. Y'all playing with folks emotion over here. Woo! Those last two are strong as hell. We're going outside because in here it's hot. The tour was amazing. So you guys can take a few pictures and like the next two or three minutes we'll head on back inside. Our okay. awesome tour guide. She was amazing, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Definitely come and check her out. Thank you. <laughs> you do YouTube? Yeah. Nice. What's your name? Marie's an Empress. Okay, I gotta follow you. I like your hair though. Thank it's you. Cute. I like yours too. What's Thank that? A twist up? Um, I'm so This morning, I added half a five down, which is why the friends are slick back. And right before my tour with you guys, I took out the hair tech and my head was hurting me. So, yeah, we got some pretty curls on that. Thank bed. you. You're welcome. 24 and a half, one, she's 35. One's an alcohol content change. So I'll let you guys know. Is that okay? Yeah. yeah. Alrighty, so the first flavor I'm top for you guys would have been Island Orange. However, what did we do with the Island Orange? <laughs> Count of three. One, two, three. Cheers! Cheers! Cheers. Hey! Yes. Hey! That's open. Oh! Dave, what the hell? Oh. That's a barrel range room. Oh. Hi, this is your boy JJ St. Martin. Taxi driver on St. Martin. Jehovah Transportation. It's my company. It's my Facebook page and my email address. Also, my phone number is What's up? You can call me, text, or straight call. Also have an Instagram as JJ underscore taxi11. Okay. I'm St. Martin, so I'll be your driver for St. Martin, St. Martin. Look for. These cakes both to bang. These are really good. That tour was amazing. All the flavors and everything. We tasted cake, ice cream. Chicken. chicken, not the whole chicken. chicken. What else you had? Some kind of pina colada dip with biscuit. I didn't really like, like, like that one. I don't like the crackers dipped thingy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, she said um shrimp, some yeah, coconut yeah, shrimp. I, I, I that would be good. Uh, We're having fun so far. Day two. It's going really good. Hello, <laughs> hello. The group that we were with, they were cool vibes too. So, oh, we got some AC though. Come, oh yes. Oh God. Vibe check, vibe check. One, two, one, two. Woo! So, what are we raising it out to? Ten. Ten and ten, 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 ten. Ten across the board. Tens 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 across tens the tens board. Tens tens so definitely, if you come to St. Martin, check out Tapas <laughs> Restaurant and Bar. Know. It was a hit. Definitely do uh, that. Uh, oh my Ring on my finger. You don't let it ring, 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 ring. A 
have been vlogging on my DJI Osmo Pocket 3. One of the guys who did the tour with us, he was so intrigued with this camera. And it's a pretty cool camera, you know. But I have my Canon M50 and this is my DJI that I'm using. I don't know if you guys realize the change or the difference in the quality and stuff. But this one is a quick camera to pull out and very discreet especially since a lot of people aren't used to having cameras all up in their faces and stuff and I understand that they've just went to this market to get some water because remember that speech what did I whole I had I did a whole speech with y'all about water on trips I still have mine so how much is this 51 fluid ounces for how many ounces make a gallon guys if I had internet this is something I would have researched and I probably researched this already but forgot <laughs> swim up bar and there's a beach right next seems like we're having some issues checking in there seems to have been a mix-up so it's taken a while to get our keys to head to our room I don't know what happened but and there's also a cafe This is the kitchen. Issues left behind me start. So you know, if you like cooking up a storm. Ooh, coffee maker. I wonder if I have the stuff to make the coffee though. Nothing you say makes it better. Not the baking pans. Okay. Pots and pants. Pots and pants. Bring it right back, right back. Empty. What we got down here? Ooh, forks and spoons, forks and spoons, openers, knives, yeah. Okay, more cooking stuff. Coffee stuff, but where's the coffee dishwasher? And this is the fridge. Garbage bin, we appreciate the water. Thank you for having water in the room. So we have a couch, some nice paintings, and it's a pretty decent room. TV. I don't ever watch TV on vacation. I don't know. I don't watch TV at home. Period. But baby, no, we've been here before. Give me the real this time. No cat, no lies. Thank you, man. There we go. So nice good talk. <laughs> Just ate breakfast. It was okay. We ate at dang. I don't know. Film the place for you guys. But this was a breakfast fit. We're gonna change and head to a. I was gonna say pool. A beach party in Anguilla, which is another island nearby. Changed really quick. And then we're going to head to the ferry terminal. The boat leaves at 10.30. It's 10.07. Babe has been doing really good with driving, to be honest. Driving in a foreign country for the first time and being really good at it. I would never know. <laughs> I'm a scaredy cat when it comes to driving. I mean, even though one day I know I will get over my fears of driving elsewhere, but I know. And I haven't really been getting to show you guys my fit, but I'm wearing a cover up from Amazon and my bathing suit is from Be Fine. You guys saw this pattern before, it's in one piece. <laughs>
the heat we under. So we found a little spot. So we're just gonna chill here for a little bit. I had needed a hat, an umbrella. What else? Ice pack. <laughs> Some towels. We were not prepared. But I had a feeling it would have been really hot though. And then I had a feeling we would have been fighting for shade. But I didn't think it would have been this bad. But it is what it is. We made it back to St. Martin. Ignore the hair. I bought some satin scrunch scrunchies because I forgot mine and they came in handy. Y'all are heat. I had to put my hair up. I couldn't. I couldn't do it. I'm happy that we made it back safe though. You checking you checking the scene? You wanted to go somewhere? I want some water and I want some ice cream. My food down there. Wanna walk down the street? That was an experience, guys. Yeah, unprepared there is something similar to that that happens on our island called christmas in july and i've never been to it for this exact reason it's just the heat y'all I can't, I can't do it we had some food you guys saw me have some food it wasn't the best tasting but when you're hungry you don't eat anything to satiate oh we couldn't fly the drones because it was an airport zone today was just different but you know you live and you learn, you experience different things. I'm just being careful with this traffic because this is not my yard. I mean, they won't want to come to another man's country and dead. God forbid. I haven't used you guys all day so you're kind of blurry welcome back we not too long ago made it back now we're going to go into the pool because we didn't touch water today and now this woman is watching me like I'm crazy because I have this camera in my hand vlogging but you know we're just getting used to vlogging in public in front of people <sighs> so I showed you guys the pool area before right next to it is a basketball court tennis court and I put my hair up the pool looks good though can't wait to get in the hair has been lasting pretty good we're going to the movies later we were supposed to do that yesterday but people were tired there's a cinema right next to us called the Caribbean cinemas it's a chain of cinemas that can be found in specific Caribbean islands not on my island there isn't any I should have taken off some of my jewelry though I love this one. Got it from Amazon. There's diamonds around the two edges. There's diamonds in the elephant. So these are elephants. It looks like it's going to rain though. Yeah, I am so not tired. It's just that the sun beat us up today. And I have this funny story that I want to tell you guys. But I'll tell you later. I want to go in the water. I want to show you guys the swimsuit. So this is a swimsuit. It's from Be Fine. You guys have seen this design or pattern. The print. Yes, you guys have seen this print before for my birthday. So this is just the one piece to it. gonna chill in the water for a little bit so talk to you guys later Six bones in the human body. Good morning. 
so today I'm gonna explore. Um, I wanna check out the gym. You may have to pay to use the gym, but I'm gonna find out how much and see if it's worth doing. But I just actually want to get some steps in and then I'm gonna explore the stores and everything around the area. I like to explore and I don't mind doing it by myself. So it's 9.20 right now. Good morning. I paid six dollars to use the gym and they're closing in an hour for maintenance. I want to do my walk and get my steps in. Right now I'm aiming for at 10k steps when I go back home. I want to aim for 20k steps for the month. I'm happy that I can get some steps in so that's always good. And I have my scrunchie just in case I want to put my hair up. Shoot! I didn't bring any water. I'm happy that I can get to work out. This is the fit. Walk is done. Ooh, it's windy. I did about 7k steps. Now I'm just walking down the street of the resort to explore a little bit. I saw that they had this smoothie place too. I can do with a smoothie right now. There's a lot of doors and shops within walking distance. Hello. I'm good. There are a lot of shops around the area so this is a very good area if you don't have a rental like if you want to walk around and just just walk get some steps in so i got a strawberry banana smoothie just so i can keep up on my fruit intake the boys the men they're doing brunch slash breakfast for today so yeah we're gonna enjoy that but I feel good now that I've gotten some movement in. I'm gonna walk down a little bit more to show you guys some more, or I should just start heading back and show you guys tomorrow because my battery is dying. So, yeah, I'll do that tomorrow. I'm gonna go back to the room now because I'm sure my boyfriend is probably worried, you know. And I don't have Wi Fi outside of the hotel. Anyway, on the resort, you'll have Wi Fi, but once you leave, you won't have any Wi Fi. But my boyfriend has eSIM downloaded on his phone. I'm going in the pool. This is gonna be my first swim up bar experience. It's cold. Yeah, I just have on my exercise clothes. You working? Oh, you can step up. Are you good? Then I get it. You know how to make a painkiller? Depends what kind of paint you want to kill. You know about the drink painkiller? Oh, about the drink. Yeah. You know how to make it? Can I have one for you? <laughs> I asked him to make a painkiller. Not so bad. We're getting served breakfast. Is it breakfast or this? <laughs> this it's 12 30. What do you call breakfast, brunch, and lunch all together? <laughs> Right. It's gonna be a five course. Replunch. Replunch. You gotta make your friend. Replunch. Replunch. Hashtag. <laughs> we just just trolling now, but to be honest, we appreciate the boys making us breakfast. We love it. Oh, breakfast. Replunch. Replunch. But we were enjoying ourselves in the pool. Good vibes. So you getting back happy? No, we can't wait. What time are we getting ready for? Um. Then I will do not happy hour yet and see, but then again, I don't I gotta do makeup so I don't want to Yeah. Do I haven't done makeup for the trip. We're going to dinner and then the club. Club hopping. Let's see what St. Martin's nightlife is about. It shall be interesting. Then I have their music whole camera crew in the Listen. kitchen. Listen! <laughs> Mess with them. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, what's she like? What's she like? That's your uh, cup, man. He's like, hey. Thank you, know you I mean? guys. Appreciate it, man. I love I like it. the collaborative efforts. 
the men did that with breakfast man no I need to drink more water on this trip. My lips are starting to be very chapped. I'm gonna eat this rum cake and just take a little nap. We're going to dinner later tonight. I already booked the reservation for you wow. I need to take a nap for 8 p.m. So I'm gonna do my makeup and try to do something with my hair. The initial style that I wanted to do, I don't have everything that I need. I'm gonna make something chic with the hair. Probably gonna try to rock a low puff, but we'll see. So yeah, I'm gonna eat this, take a little nap, and just think about how amazing this trip has been so far. I'm grateful, thankful, just happy to be here. I'm gonna mm mm mm, -mm and mm mm mm. Hey guys, I'm up. Now it's time to do the makeup. We're going to dinner tonight at this restaurant called Jack's Steakhouse. So I'm doing my makeup. I'm happy that my skin has been behaving. I've only had like two, two active breakouts, but I don't really wear makeup on vacation to be honest. Because I like for my skin to breathe. Especially when you have acne, I feel like makeup or wearing a lot of makeup tends to just slow the healing process. So I just put on my primer on. But I need to move quick. I mixed my foundations. I'm using the LA Girl Pro Coverage HD, HD, HD High Def. And yeah, I just woke up, so I'm fighting. I'm fighting for my words right now. Long wear illuminating foundation, rich cocoa, and dark chocolate. So my color is in between these two. I can get away with this one when I get darker. But right now, since I'm on vacation, I got a little lighter. But this is too orange. On vacation, I don't leave the house, so my skin to my skin gets at least three, two to three shades lighter actually. Dinner last night and the movies. Dinner was good. The Chinese restaurant we went to, it was good. A lot. I usually do my eyebrows first. The food was good. I love Chinese food. I had beef and broccoli. And then at the movies, y'all. Yeah. We watched Deadpool and I fell asleep. I really fell asleep. I can't stay up while watching movies. Like, I don't know if it's my attention span or if the movie's just not what I'm into. Because I'm really into Marvel and DC type movies. Anything else, y'all? Yeah action and all those things that like, I really be trying to stay up <laughs> and it doesn't it doesn't work out so everyone else enjoyed the movie but I was asleep so I don't know I watched certain parts of it but to be honest it, it just wasn't my cup of tea oh this is a nice match though and it literally melted into my skin love that I take time to blend I usually do my eyebrows first but they're not as bushy as they usually are so but yeah, I'm just gonna shape them up a little bit. When your eyebrows are done, it makes it a lot easier. When I say done, I mean shaped. These are the new brushes that I bought. I do want to get some high-end makeup, but I don't want to order them. I need to go in person. And I don't know when I'm gonna go to America again. <laughs> I'll probably wanna go sometime this year, to be honest. Check up on my besties. Okay, these new brushes are coming in clutch. They're making application so much easier. I really don't be doing much of my makeup. I recently got this as well. Just pat that and set. So we have dinner reservations at 8. Right now it's 6.05. So I'm good on time. I forgot to do my eyeshadow. I'm so rusty when it comes to makeup. Especially back home with that heat. Mm -mm. Especially in my room. Right now I have AC. So you know apply the makeup go and sing and not sweat it out can't wait to show you guys the dress though it's a dress from kai collective black owned so what i'm doing as well is having at least one black owned one or two black owned pieces when i go on vacation yeah i don't have a scissors so I had to use this to cut off the piece of lash because of course they always come too long look at this extra piece just ignore this okay the lash glue is taking forever to dry half of it isn't dry so i have to reapply more lash glue but hopefully i just don't end up just taking the entire lash off but i need a better lash glue this is not working out my favorite color to wear on vacation so wearing my natural hair on vacation isn't all that bad and the makeup looks really good too lashes would have elevated the look a lot more but still cute <laughs> of course 
dress. We're so cute. What are you talking about? This is the fit. Got this dress from Kai Collective. Shoes from Amazon. And I'm also going to wear this bag with the outfit. You guys saw the ATV fit, right? Do I need to reverse and do it again? This tracking is so fun. I'm still getting used to this camera, guys. So as I told you, we're going ATV riding today. And we're gonna have a beautiful day, aren't we? We have one more full day of vacation and then we travel out the next day. I'm trying not to think about it, you know? I'm really trying not to think about it, but I guess we gotta do vacations more often. All right, they're ready. They are ready now. Come in, babe. They're ready. You never feel the way I feel. You don't know if my love is real, baby. Listen to me. Here's the deal. When you're not here, I'm not the same. I'm needing a new chapter, babe. In a bed for days I've been staring at the telephone Cause when you're gone I miss your face Late o'clock Body clock Oh my god Look Godzilla Everybody got lit? Hi Godzilla. Males are the one with the bigger spikes. Hi Godzilla. Females are the one with the smaller spikes. I got one in my hand. What I have here is a young male. All right. Now this on the side of his face. This is how he can breathe below the water for 15 to 30 minutes. All right. So now the claws are dangerous. Even the tail. So if you pass your hands down in the middle, you don't feel the sharpness. So if you pass it up. Okay. See that? So that's why the tail is the weapon. Oh. Now if the tail busts on the black, it grows back black. It busts on the gray right here. It grows back gray. So whatever oh. color it busts, that's the color it's gonna grow back. Never get back the stripe. All right. Anybody want to try home? Nope. Nope. No, I'm not sure. Oh. Nobody. You just oh, hold it. How much pressure no. you're playing? A lot. Oh, no. How much what? How much pressure? Oh, oh he's coming behind you. Not that. Okay. 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 I think you're a tough man. Hey! 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 Well, they come from the zoo. When the zoo had damage, that's what they started from. 
You didn't answer my question. Just bite. Look at that. Oh, my father never Watch you saying, Bolt <laughs> now. They said it's about a hundred of them in this area. I want that big man come over here. No, He's just over there chilling. <laughs> hey, what's the you go on a call? Food, food. Oh my, oh no, oh hair, oh my, yeah, wait, 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 this is making me itch. Yeah, I know. Probably that's why. Y'all yeah. ready? One. Get ready to go. Wait. Two. Don't know what else to say. Don't go nowhere. And three. Animal cruelty. It's <laughs> animal cruelty. Find it. Find it, you say? Oh, we're going across there. We. Oh, my gosh. I tell you all they can spend 15 to 20 minutes below water. Oh, wow. so they can stay below there for 15 to 30 minutes. You see how quick kind of moves are done? If you want to see that, more going to come up. The, the turtles, turtles. Oh, they think it's they're late. Like, oh, right there. Oh, you can't swallow rock. Oh. Oh. Oh, <laughs> they think it's food, but they need to be clean. Look at all the green stuff. Who can number? Uh, that's good for them. The lolly, the fish is below it. There's catfish below. Oh, there's other fishes here. And duck and thing. Yeah, the ducks are there too. Mm -hmm. This is just a little habitat for them. We can't really do much with it. Right. Oh, so much more coming. That time so much more coming from the same. Look at the bigger guys and the tree guys. Look up on the tree. taking us through some water. That's why they recommended that you wear water shoes. We're having so much fun so far. All right, so guys, we're gonna take our time and walk straight to the middle. Okay. We're gonna take our time because then we're gonna find some stuff in the water to show you how to put the water. Nice and rich to Right now it's on the head right now. This is called a walk, what is this called again? The Moses Walk. The Moses, the Moses walk. walk. All right, so guys, we're gonna walk straight to the middle. Just take our time in the middle. Don't follow me, I'm going to crumb the water and see if I find some stuff. What kind of stuff are you talking about, sir? <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? This ain't bad compared to yesterday. What y'all did yesterday? It took a charter boat for like seven hours or whatever, like five islands. <laughs> that sounds fun though. They always trying to make jokes on short. It feels good too, right? Yeah, it feels yeah. good. I thought it was gonna be cold though, right? I know, right? Walk, walk, <laughs> walk. <laughs> oh my god. What am I looking like, guys? What am I really looking like? You know, we love the adventure. You should be here though. What you at? You at home watching this video, wishing you was here. I know, right? Let's go. Let's go to St. Martin. <laughs> we made it to the top. Ouch, yeah. So this is a sea star, the beautiful sea star. That's sarcasm, guys. <laughs> the baby lobster. Where were you saying name Nathaniel? Nathaniel. <laughs> Hi, baby Nathaniel. At least I find something else again. <laughs> center of attention now and he feels good about it and she takes a bow cause she's the center of attention now and she feels good about it but I'm a good and nice every time that I'm out cause it's scary being seen in daylight I 
keep the look at close and maybe they might See right through me, see right through me And I don't know why I just can't have it What everybody seem to take for granted Wondering if I'm from another planet Somewhere far away I might as well be on the moon Forty, almost two o'clock, and house clean hasn't cleaned her room yet. Yeah, that's a bummer. But that's that's not good. We weren't here all morning, so we were hoping that they would have cleaned the room. And we need some more towels. Y'all, yeah, my skin is burnt. I'm just laying on in a chair. But y'all, yeah, we had so much fun. I think I told you guys that already. But I am tired. I am beat out. It's the sun. The sun, yeah, it's hot. Real hot. Driving the ATV in the heat. So we're gonna decompress and we're going to head to a beach club later to just chill. Catch your vibes. But I need a nap. I need a quick nap. spoken to you guys in a while so i'm going for a walk on the simpson bay strip i'm gonna do some exploring by myself there's this hookah lounge i saw and i just want to check it out i'm just zen you guys are gonna be my company to help keep me safe so look out for me fun fact when i went to school in atlanta y'all we, we used to just go walking around the place there was this one time we walked for about five, 45 minutes imagine walking for 45 minutes to go to a restaurant who you know i was just to go at that time i don't think we had uber at that time we literally used to walk everywhere but i want to tell you guys what happened all year though that had me pissed the hell off 
when we first came in our rooms weren't ready so we had to wait until like after four to be checked into our rooms so it seems like it's a customary for housekeeping to clean the rooms late usually on vacation when you leave the hotel in the morning you know when you come back your room would be clean but that wasn't happening so yesterday they didn't clean our room because they came too late and we were already in bed late now because we were tired right so today they were gonna do the same thing but that inconvenienced me because we told them we were leaving for four if they could have come back until yeah they were like no we can't come back to four literally they would have just had to come back in like 30 minutes after they inconvenienced us by not cleaning the room in the morning right she said she didn't get to clean it because she had to do a check-in so i guess that was more important to clean that room versus us okay fine but you inconvenienced us now you could get a little inconvenienced too no i was like no had to get ready in just in five minutes to ten minutes so I just put on this dress that i wore for this romper that i wore to breakfast some day ago so i was annoyed like i was really annoyed because it was such a cute spot it's called color tour such a cute aesthetic spot for some nice pictures and stuff because i think yesterday they came like close to five six to clean the rooms like what are y'all doing but hey it is what it is so that's one one of the things that i don't like so far about the hotel i'm on simpson bay strip you can swear from here let me act like i'm from here i don't really care to share my frustration with others because trust me it takes a lot for me to get frustrated like a lot and when i get frustrated it's like very hard for me to like not come out of it but i just I just don't want to talk. I don't want to talk. I'd be cool, but I just don't care to talk. Especially when people don't understand like how you feel. Why bother? I'm walking on Simpson Bay Strip, and you guys are keeping me company. So look out for me, okay? Have my back. Literally, have my back. But I'll be fine. As I was telling y'all, living in Atlanta, I don't know. I don't know if it was a grace of God. But probably when I left Atlanta is when it became even more dangerous. But your girl used to be walking them streets by herself. Scared as hell, but sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. And I'm getting my steps in too, so that's good. One thing I can tell you guys about me though is that I'm very absorbent. I've scooped out where everything is already, so I know how to get around just by paying attention and looking. I made it, y'all. Made it safe. I already ordered my hookah. Oh, it's hot though. I have a little space for myself. I'm not that hungry, or else I would have gotten something to eat, but probably not because I still have leftover steak. Well, a whole meal from yesterday. I'm not that hungry to be honest. <laughs> Thank you. I forgot to ask you for the Wi-Fi password. I also got some wine and chairs to us. Good looking out guys, good looking out. Just gonna chill here for a little bit and then head back to the resort and then we're going to club. I forgot the name of the club. Club Lotus tonight. We went to another club the other night and it wasn't really given much and in there was hot as hell we're heading home now i need you guys to do your job again look out for your girl i'm getting a lot of cat calls right now it's after 10. the area has a lot of tourists hanging around so i won't say that it's safe because you just never know the hotel is literally right around the corner and let me show you guys some of the spots in the surrounding area while walking to my hotel so the strip has tons of well not tons but the strip has an abundance of restaurants shops made it to the hotel safely guys this is tonight's look i love it so we're going to club lotus to see what it's given because we went out the other night and mm -mm. i literally got ready in like what 45 minutes the hair needs to be redone but we still look cute St. Martin. Um, we were supposed to go to Lottery Farms today to go 
hiking and zip lining. I don't think we're doing that again. I really would have loved to zip line and hike though. You guys, we're still waiting on everyone. I'm gonna go back to the same spot that I got a smoothie from to get one real quick. And then we're gonna walk around the town area. My mom said she wants a souvenir or a fridge magnet. I'm gonna get that for her. And I don't really want anything. I can probably get a souvenir for myself as well. I had all my hiking clothes and all. I would have worn a different pair of shoes. So I just put on my slippers, my sandals, sorry. Morning. We're gonna enjoy our last day. Cause we're leaving early tomorrow morning. The trip was definitely too short. There's so much to explore in St. Martin still that we didn't get to do. Yeah, we needed some more days. Oh, and there's also a supermarket on the property. Walking down Front Street. Checking out and heading to the airport now.